YouTube. Today I have here Pioneer MVH-S300 Bluetooth with a FLAC support, equalizer of 13 bands, mm, karaoke something, Android Auto something. Was it Android Auto? Quick charge for rapid charge for Android, <coughs> not Android Auto. Well, anyhow. A new model from Pioneer, a uh, cheap model, 129 euros, and we'll be checking out the clipping of the internal amplifier and the RCA outputs. <coughs> now I have here a DSO-138, a small, cheap uh, oscilloscope, and link in description if you want to buy one, really nice as you can see uh, very soon. So first of all we are uh, using a 40 Hz sine wave here with a USB just to check out how high we can turn it up before it goes into distortion. It is 0 dB track so <coughs> keep in mind that normal music is normally uh, mastered at around minus 5, minus 4 uh, sometimes d more down but around there minus 6 to minus 4 dB so it will be this song is about 4 decibels louder than normal songs but uh, nowadays people make these decaf songs and bass boosted songs and they are at around 0 dB so this is the loudest digital format you can have so Let's just raise the volume, as, and we can see here the internal amplifier from the front uh, front output, and here we can see one subwoofer RCA output. Now when we are raising O, we found already our clipping on our internal amplifier, which is around 45 volume. So this is 46, and this is 45. As you can see on the bottom side we still have very 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 minor distortion but the upside should look okay. Actually both are about equally the same but hey. <coughs> That's around 45 volume. So this head unit goes up to 62 volume. So it's around 3 to uh, uh, 3 slash four times of the volume so 75 percent about of the volume the uh, internal amplifier goes into distortion but how about the rcas at this stage you have <laughs> around uh, nine volts so that's about uh, 10 15 amp uh, wattages and we're just checking this back here and as you can see on the RCA, RCA side, we can have we have a uh, 0.36 volts. Uh, so you can probably use this as maximum volume of 45, and still use your gains uh, set up to 0.2 volts. You have gain roughly up from 0.2 to uh, 4 or 8 volts. So you can set your gains as high as 0.2 volts. Uh, to have it, uh, uh, this actually will distort some of your amplifier output if you put it on 0.2 volts. But you can have very much loud bass out from your amplifier. Standard amplifiers usually take up to 0.2 volts. <coughs> now that is uh, the maximum of gain is 0.2 volts and the minimum of gain is 4 volts. It just gain tells... Uh, setting the gain tells how much voltage is coming around, uh, coming from here. It's not a volume knob. Anyhow, uh, more of this. Uh, so we will be just checking now next uh, when the RCA side goes into distortion. We are at 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62. And there we can see at, at around 60 volts, uh, 60 volume we are still quite nice. Uh, actually the upper side here is probably a little bit distorted and as we can see Vmax is almost 3 volts, Vmin is 2.7 volts. Now I'm not sure if it is the calib calibration of this device uh, it, that it has a 0 .0 0 0.3 volts variation but VRMS is around 2 volts so that should be enough for any, any amplifier <coughs> uh, and that's the point where it goes into distortion. Whoops. My test bench is not that great, but hey, it works. And as you can see, the internal amplifier is really, really distorted. Like heavily distorted. 
Now if we go down to 45 and underneath that, we can test out the loudness and the bass of this. This actually had some kind of bass here, deep bass. First of all, loudness low, loudness medium, distorted, loudness high, very distorted. So you can go like, I set it up to high, no mid high, now it's on high, loudness high. <laughs> And we go back, so we can only put around like 30, uh, 30, 31, 32, 33, it goes to distorted, so 32 volume for when you have loudness maximum on. And here we have 0 0.03, uh, so uh, the loudness only affects on the internal amplifier, not the RCA signal. If we put this volume to the maximum here, maximum distorted, undistorted, so that's around 60 volume, this is still 1.93, uh, a nice nice wave, and if we take here the loudness off, audio loudness off, we can see that it does not affect on the RCA side. Now next, I will be testing deep bass, and we'll be putting deep bass to low, oh we have RCA on distortion, deep bass to high, we are very much in distortion. Now if we go back here, I'll over the volume, we can find out waste the time, it's around 56 now, <laughs> so it's uh, 55 probably, when the RCA signal starts to distort, and we have 1.77 volts, if we put to 56 volt, we have around 1.93, that's actually the highest maximum we already had, and on the 57 volts, the upside goes heavily distorted and the downside is not. So with this, I can clearly say that the volume 56 is maximum when you're using deep bass. Uh, because deep bass <coughs> affects on the RCA output also. But the sine wave is clear and nice. Now let's see how low we can go with the internal amplifier. What is that happening there? Oh... That looks quite bad. So let's just check it out here. Audio deep bass off, deep bass low, deep bass high. As you can see, deep bass really affects on the uh, downside of the sine wave. It looks horrific. Now that is distorted audio signal. It's not on distortion, so it's not clipping. But uh, if you play a clear, clear sine wave and it does something kind of this, it alters the signal so much that I really, I really cannot recommend using deep bass anywhere, anyhow. But it, as it seems, it does not really affect, if I go uh, back here and back here, and if I raise the volume here, it does not really affect on the RCA side. Uh, but only thing it affects that it uh, hires it so that it goes distortion into after 56 volume. 56 is still clean. Now that's about it. Uh, of the Alpine head unit, uh, oh sorry, Pioneer head unit. And the, as you can see, deep bass do not use it, loudness do not use it, just use the internal amplifier with maximum of 45 volume. And if you are not using the internal amplifier, use the RCA up output up to 60 volume. And you should be okay playing normal music, not a heavily bass, bass boosted music. But that is just awful, no, that should not happen. Okay, like if you like, dislike if you dislike, and leave a comment, what do you think about this Pioneer, not Alpine, Pioneer head unit, MVH S300 Bluetooth. And we see you on the next video, bye bye. Thank <laughs> you.